Hey guys, today I'm here to do a sit down video, which is feels really really weird because I feel like I haven't done one of these in ages. But as you can tell, probably by the title and where I'm sitting, that this is going to be a haul video, a thrift store haul. And I want to show you what you can get for roughly $100 at a thrift store when they have a sale. Also, my mom works there so we get the sale price every day but we did go on a sale day so I wanted to show you what I got and a lot of this stuff is going to be Christmas gifts to the kids so I just figured I would go through this as quick as possible and show you what I got. So the first thing that I got is actually this sweater here which I thought was pretty cute. Um, still have the tag on it and it was regular $3.99 but because we get the 50 off, it was $2. So you can't really go wrong for a Christmas sweater for $2. The reason why I actually went in there is because, oh, hi, Hardy boy. The reason why I went in there is because Damien really needed sweaters and like jogging pants. So that's why I went and they had a kid's sale for 50% off. And I'm gonna get rid of this right now because it's uh, bugging me. But anyways, so I'm going to go through, get down, get down. I'll go through, I've kind of sorted it so that all the prices are the same and you can kind of get a feel of what their pricing is like. But I do know the way the pricing system works there and it just really depends on the person that's working that day. So anyways, I'll start off with the cheapest sweaters first. Which is funny because I feel like they're the best quality. So these two sweaters that I got Damien are size 7 and 10. So obviously this stuff is going to be throughout the years. But I did try and get a lot of stuff that he needed now. And he is in like a 6-7 right now. So these were both priced at $2.50. So this is the first one. Let me zip it up. This is the first one. And it's got like a really fuzzy inside perfect for winter and then this one and this one is just like a regular fleece inside so these were 250 each but because of the sale I got them for a dollar 25 so honestly you cannot go wrong for two great quality sweaters for $2.50 for the both of them. So the way I try and go through a thrift store is I go super super fast. I already know what my taste is for my children and for myself so I can judge something within like the first second of seeing it whether or not I would buy it. So then I grab what I like initially, throw it all in my cart, and then I'll go through things afterwards and see if it's worth the price and if there's any stains on it and things like that. So I just go through and try and grab the best quality stuff, newer looking stuff, and yeah. So this is actually a sweater that Damien has had once before, except for his was a zip up. And all of these sweaters that I have here are regular $3.99. So that's roughly what they price their kids' sweaters at, but sometimes you get good deals like $2.50. These were all $2 a piece. So we have a Red Gap one. This one is the brand Head, I believe. And I've never heard of it, but I'm assuming it's some sort of like active wear like this which i thought was pretty cute and he'll wear that now actually i should be telling you the sizes so this is a six and this is a 12. you can kind of tell by the sizing that the sizing doesn't always line up with like what they're actually sized at this one is a medium eight to nine years another gap which is actually one that he'll fit into now. So I kind of just judge it by the way it looks rather than the actual size. This one is for later. This is a size 12, but I grabbed it anyways because I know it's a great deal. A $2 fox sweater and I love the colors of it. And it's got the fox on the hood. This next one is Tony Hawk which I really liked. It's like brand new condition. And this is a 14, so this will be put away uh, probably not next year, but the next year because he is quite tall for his age. This one is not something I normally pick, 
but I just thought it was something cool that Damien might like that he would be interested in and this is a size 7 and it's just got like a claw effect but it then it has this hood and it's got like a skull and like a frilly hood so I thought that was cool and it's actually see-through so he can technically zip it up and put it over his eyes but I don't think I'm gonna show him that because I don't want him wearing it like that at school or any time basically but I thought it was pretty cool. And then the last sweater I got was another Gap and we ton find a ton of Gap stuff, but it's this brown and beige and I love the quality of Gap. I feel like they can be worn forever. So, but these are all pretty much brand new condition and this is a size eight, which will fit him now. So those are all the sweaters that he got. Really good deals once again. And then the next thing was pants. So I'll show you from cheapest to most expensive. And these two pairs were $1.50 regular. So that means they were 75 cents each. And I mean, how can you go wrong? These are no size, but they just uh, look like they would fit him. And they're Champion. I think that's Champion brand. There's no tag, but anyways. Yeah, so those will fit him for sure. Just a plain black pair of joggers. These are Athletic Works, a 7 to an 8, and they're just a red pair of joggers. Now, Damien has a ton of jeans that I picked up over the years, usually from Giant Tiger for like five bucks a piece, but I just find they're annoying to wear for him. He feels like he can't move in them, so he's always in joggers. If they get ruined for 75 cents, who freaking cares? <laughs> okay, so the next pairs are regular two fifty. So these would have been a dollar twenty five, and these ones are just a gray pair, and they have like tight bottoms. And these are a size seven, which will fit them now. And then these ones are Joe Fresh and a size eight, and they say Wildcats on them, but. Damien doesn't care so there's those ones and then these ones were regular $3.99 which means I paid two dollars for them and these ones are Joe Fresh again size 8 these ones say Brooklyn looks like Panthers or something but once again doesn't really matter Damien don't care these ones are definitely not for right now, but I picked them up because I, they look like a really good deal. Uh, they look brand new from West 49 and they're a size 12 and they're just a plain gray jean. So I figure by the time he gets to that age, he'll be wearing something more like this rather than joggers. The next ones are size 10 and I bought in these exact same pair of pants but like with a blue one before and he's actually in them now and then you'll see actually the exact same set in gray and orange and i love these pants for damien they are such good quality these are a 10 12 which he'll probably wear next year and these are a 10 12 as well so and then the next ones are just garbage ones for the property. They're just kind of like worn a little bit, but they're just something that he can throw on and I don't care if he ruins them. These are a size eight. Oh, and what brand are they? Oh, they're Old Navy. Okay, and the next sets are the most expensive. So this is a pair of snow pants, $4.99. So I got them for $2.50, a size six. And they are worn at the bottom. But Damien's snow pants are actually getting too small and he goes through snow pants like crazy during the day. So his teachers actually want two pairs sent. So that's why I bought these just because, I mean, he can throw them on, he can ruin them, he can get them wet and it doesn't matter. And then these next ones are $5.99 a piece. So that means I got them for $3 and these are Michael Jordan ones, size medium. And I thought Damien would really like these. Because his favorite color is red. He'll get those probably next year for Christmas. And these are Puma and extra large. Which are definitely bigger. But I wanted to grab them because I really like them. They have Puma on the side. And then these are Nike. And they're more of just like a dry fit type 
pant, but he will get these for Christmas. Okay, so that is it for pants. And Damien loves his sleepers and we tried to get him out of them a little while ago and it was just like, why are we doing this? He loves them, he enjoys them, he he doesn't wear them to school unless it's pajama day, so what's it matter? <laughs> so I picked him up a couple and this one is $3.99 so I got it for $2 and it's a size 7 and it has the feet. This one is super cool. Once again, it's a size 7, $3.99, so I got it for $2, and it's got like this wolf on it, and this one has no feet. This one was, I thought, cool too, but it's a little bit bigger. It's got a dinosaur on it with dinosaurs all over it, and it's a size 12, so he, he won't get this one probably till next year or the year after. And then this one has skulls all over it. Oh, and I forgot to mention, he loves the sleepers with the hoods, so that's why we did it. And this one's got a skull, and this one's a size 8, so he'll be eating that now. And then the last couple things that Damien is getting, uh, this is an Under Armour, and it's size medium, size 10, but he'll fit that probably this year or even into next year. And this was $2.49 regular, so $1.25. And then this other top is a size 14, and it says Diesel on it, the brand Diesel. But I thought it was cool because his dog is named Diesel. <laughs> and then I got this really nice jacket. I really, really like it. It's from H&M, and it is a size 8 and 9. And he'll fit it now, probably. But it's just a really nice quality coat. So I know he'll like that. So that's what Damien is getting. A lot of that stuff will be for Christmas. And then some of the older stuff obviously I'll put away. I have other stuff for him for Christmas that I bought in previously that I've probably done videos on. I just put it in a tote and label it what size and when it's for Christmas or his birthday or whatever and then I just kind of pick and choose what to give him so anyways that is what I got Damien obviously he got the most clothes because he wears the most clothes and he wears out the most clothes <laughs> so I'm going to jump to Michaela quickly and then I have a few things for Sophia and then Kyle okay so when I went to the girls section I noticed that I guess somebody had twins and I found a really like quite a few sets for Christmas for twins twin girls but this is the set I found for like a gender neutral and this is what I'm going to give Sophia and Damien to wear for Christmas and they're just like a red plaid with a penguin on it and the exact same set for Sophia, David and Sophia. And then because obviously I didn't find a triplet set, <laughs> I bought this for Michaela. Oh, I didn't say these were these were three ninety nine, so I got them for two dollars a piece, and they're size seven. So obviously for Sophia, she's not going to be in a size seven, but I can rig them up so that they fit her no problem. And then, so this is what I bought for Michaela for the morning of Christmas. And it's just got like a pretty sparkly snowflake. And this is actually Victoria's Secret, a extra small. And it's regular $6.99. So I got it for $3.50. It's a 90. I found another 90 for Michaela just for the winter months. And it's Canadiana, uh, size small. Once again, $6.99. It's the women's section, so 350. And then I thought this was so cute, but I know it's gonna be a pain in the butt to get on Michaela, so I was gonna try and rig it into a nightie. It is like a bodysuit. I don't know if you can see that. It's like a bodysuit, but it has these adorable little reindeers on it, and I just thought it was so pretty. So I'm gonna rig that up and this is Urban Heritage uh, size medium and regular $6.99 so I got it for $3.50. Okay, so 
I got this sleeper for Sophia. It's a size four, regular 250, so I got it for $1.50. And this little nighty. This is a size eight, but it looks like it could she could fit it now. And a regular 250, so a dollar twenty-five. I got these pants. They're like sparkly. And these are size five, regular dollar ninety-nine, so I got them for a dollar. These I bought for her because she doesn't have anything that's like super comfy. So these are size four, regular two fifty. Got them for a dollar twenty-five. And then just this plain pink hoodie. And regular two fifty, dollar twenty-five, and that's a size five. This I thought was pretty for Sophia. It's a size six, regular two fifty again for a dollar twenty-five. Now this sweater, I haven't decided whether or not to give it to Damien or Sophia. It's a size 7, but it looks fairly small, so I'm not thinking that it's going to fit Damien. But it's just a plain gray sweater, and it's regular 250. So this is too old for Sophia, but I'm going to put it away for her just because I really liked it. It says, Happy to be me, and it's the Justice brand, and it's regular 250, so $1.25. So how could you not, right? And then once again, I found the Diesel brand. So somebody must shop Diesel, I don't know. But this is regular $5.99. So I got it for $3 and it's a size 12. So once again, I'm gonna be putting it away. And then I thought, well, maybe it could fit Kayla, but it looks too tight. So I'm gonna put it away for Sophia. And then just a pair of Joe Fresh four to five. These are a regular a dollar fifty, so I got them for seventy five cents for Sophia. And then something I thought she would like. This is Nickelodeon, uh, regular two ninety nine, size five, so three dollars. And it's got sky on it, and it says shine like the stars. And I know she loves Paw Patrol, so that's why I got that. And then this is what I got for Michaela. I got her a little bralette, and this is size 12, regular $2.99, so $1.50, and it's got like a crisscross in the back. I got her these leggings. They're old navy, size 14, regular $2.50, so I got $1.25, and I like these because they fit on your snow pants and Sometimes she gets too hot wearing snow pants and thick pants, so that's why I got these. And also in the like spring fall months, when it's too chilly to wear shorts, um, but too hot to wear thick things, she needs leggings like this, so that's why I got her those. And then I found this awesome sweater for her for Christmas, and this is regular $3.99, so I got it for $2, and it's size 12. And this is definitely more size 12, but it's a Hurley sweater. So I really liked this one for her. So that is Sophia and Michaela's pile. Okay, and then on to Kyle. I actually bought these. Where is it? Where's the other one? Okay, I bought these mittens for actually me for other property just because they're more of a heavy de duty and they're like a suede that like look like they can take some rough tough working <laughs> so they're a little tight but i know they're gonna stretch if i wear them so they'll just be really good for working and they were regular a dollar ninety nine, so I got them for a dollar. Now Kyle asked for sweaters for the property as well as pants, like jogging pants for the property. And then I just found him some things for Christmas. So half of this stuff he's gonna just have to try on and tell me if he likes it. Other stuff I know he'll actually wear Ooh. and just use and abuse so <laughs> this is I thought these were cool I don't know if he'll wear them but they are the brand Easton and they're size large so these are like I want to say like a windbreaker type pant so I don't know if he'll actually wear these out or if he'll just want to wear these to the property or whatever but anyway so they were regular $12.99 so I got them for six dollars 
and they feel like really heavy and good quality so i'm hoping that he'll wear them like out and about because he doesn't have anything really like nicer to be like comfortable in so there's that pair this pair i don't know if he'll wear out or at all even these are urban heritage extra large regular ten dollars so i got them for five and they have like the tight ankles so he'll have to try those on and let me know they are a little bit worn in some areas but once again like if he decides to wear them at the property whatever these kyle actually has like the exact same pair yeah kyle has like these exact same pair these are large and they're just like a jogger pant and they have the tight bottoms and these were regular 5.99 so i got them for three dollars these are once again a little bit nicer the the fillet brand philly 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 extra large regular 99 9.99 got them for five dollars and they have like the nice band and i tried to get things with joshing so that if they are a little big he can tighten them so they just go into like a tighter fit bottom and then once again just like these are belly don't know what brand that is but size large regular 5.99 so i would have got them for three dollars and then this is the only sweater i could find for the property it's like worn and stained a little bit but i didn't care because he really needs something warm for the property and this is something I know he would like and wear. So it just looks like that. And it's got the heavy fleece inside. And it feels really heavy. And he's actually worn some of these before. This is a G21 Walmart brand. But I think he's worn like from Stitches and Urban Heritage. And there's another one. Oh, Blue Notes. Uh, that type of thing. But... So this is an extra large and it's frailer $9.99 so I got it for $5 and I mean obviously it doesn't look that bad but there are little like spots on it like right there. So I mean it's not like something that he's gonna wear to dinner but it's something that will keep him warm at the property. And then the last thing he asked for is a coat to wear at the property that he can just ruin and work in. So this is like an older style coat, but again, it's rough, tough, and will withstand like him working in it. It does have like a roll-up hood, but I don't think he'll use that. This is Midtown brand, and it's an extra, extra large, regular $15.99. So I got it for $8, but it's really heavy, and it just looks like a work coat. There's nice pockets in it, um, some buttons, it's got the double flap zipper um, flaps so that way the wind doesn't go through and it's just like quilted and I thought it was just a really good coat to work in especially for eight dollars so once again I'll kind of go through all of this stuck stuff and pick and choose what I'm going to give for Christmas and what I'll give just right away or hold back mainly Kyle's stuff will be given right away because he needs it especially the coat so anyways, I think that is it for this video. That's what you can get for $100 at a thrift store. So you can either spend $50 on a piece of clothing at a high-end store uh, and get it brand new, or you can get it basically brand new at a thrift store and only pay a couple bucks or even a dollar. So yeah, I just figured I would share this with you. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and we will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.